Hey guys, welcome to the Indie Minute. Today I'm taking a look at The Gravedigger by Two Man Team Homegrown Games. A third person puzzle adventure game with a slightly morbid, uniquely British sense of humour, and I'm going to try and sum it up in about a minute. In The Gravedigger, you take the role of Fogus, a down on his luck Dickensian gent who is taken to grave robbing. The problem is, Fogus' local graveyards are a little livelier than he was expecting, and so he must dodge all manner of ghosts and ghouls to make way with his loot. The gameplay involves navigating a series of maze-like graveyards to dig up graves for buried treasures. Digging does however disturb the graveyard's inhabitants, so you do have to plan your digs carefully. Fogus' partner Tully can be a good source of information about each of the graveyards you visit, and gravestones can be a good indication of whether they're worth digging up or not. The game has 18 levels with a pretty smooth difficulty curve. On the lower difficulties, the first few levels won't give you too much trouble, but as the game progresses you'll have to pay close attention to enemy patterns and behaviours to slip by safely. The different types of enemies all require different tactics to avoid, and it does add a great puzzle element to the gameplay. The game is also filled with, at times, grim but generally light-hearted humour that adds to the game's charm. There's a very British, ealing comedy sort of feel to the game's humour, and it's very reminiscent to that found in British games like the Medieval series series, or games from Rare Limited in the late 90s that we don't really see much of anymore. The graphics are very lo-fi and can be a little distracting during the game's few cutscenes, but this really isn't a problem during gameplay. Some animations could be a little smoother, but the textures work nicely with the bird's eye camera and the game's excellent level design and charm is more than enough to keep you immersed even if the graphics don't excel. So that is The Gravedigger. Its low budget does show at times, but it doesn't at all diminish the solid gameplay, great atmosphere, and all-around fun that the game provides. And for only $6 on Steam, it really is a steal. The multiple difficulty options do provide some replayability, and I know I'll be coming back to it around Halloween. Thanks for watching. If you dig this video, please subscribe and let me know some more indie games you'd like to see summed up in around a minute. See you next time.